Stevens and Devos. So I want to test out the the what is it? This the Naked Skin Urban Decay, the Urban Decay Naked Skin Ultra Definition Powder. <laughs> powder foundation so the color that I have don't laugh but when I was testing it out this granted I did have something on top of it so the color that I have is um medium dark neutral because I like looking neutral yes it is light um but I can make anything work it's just that the dark that I had brought my face down. And y'all know how I feel about my face. So, yeah. So, what I am going to use today is my Sleek BB Cream along with my Scrub Liquid Lotion from MAC. This was the limited edition in Golden Luxor. So I am going to, because when I used it, I'm just jumping all over the place. When I used it the first time, I used it with a pretty high coverage um, matte foundation. And I did not like the results of it. I'm going to try to post a little bit of the clippings of it. You can't laugh, but yeah. Um, it was a little ghetto too. I was just, I don't know. I was popping my gum. I don't know. So this is what I have. So I'm going to apply it with my little kabuki brush. I'm going to mix it up too. There we go. I've already prepped my skin. I also stopped using, I think it's Pond's, it was in my, my <laughs> yearly favorites. It was the Pond's, um, Palm, lo Palm, <laughs> Palm, Pond's, um, I think it was, I don't know what it was. It was the stuff that I was using for my face because my face was dry. God, this looks really good, don't it? By itself, I hate that I'm gonna put lotion on. I mean, put something else on. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm trying to think what brush should I use. I was gonna use a kabuki brush, but I'm not going to. I'm gonna use my um, powder brush from Zoeva. The 106 even though I look at it it still takes time for me I'm just gonna blot this on my now see I like this way better I'm just gonna buff it in now quick I wish I would have hooked it I like it I like it way better than I did the first time I tested it out the first time I tested it out I didn't like it and um, I'm going to do the rest of my face and come back to you okay On this foundation I feel like this foundation is really it's really it's okay um I like it whoa I'm only saying whoa because I see it you may not see it but I see it 
it's a um i'm using these 3d lash fibers that i'm trying to hurry up and get rid of so i can just be done with it um the coverage is really nice i like it over a bb cream i don't think i would like it over foundation um yeah the coverage is really nice my pimples are coming out again but they're not like how they were in the in the clip that i will insert and i will try to if i don't work out too hard i will try to come back and let you see how it looks at the end of the day so yeah um it's, it's a nice coverage long i think i like it more i think it's because it's so matte I, my skin is so dry it's just like no boo boo no so if you have oily skin i think you may like it and it could be the fact that i use this brush this brush is much more denser than this brush so this has a lot it's more compact i really need to clean my table off but yeah um let me know how if you have this foundation how do you like it do you think that the coloring is a tad bit off like i know that that's really light but as you see like i look cohesive let me see if i can back up some. so i look cohesive and you saw how light that is so i'm just saying um i think it might run a little light i know definitely the dark was like too dark it brought my whole entire look down at least to me i mean when I look at skin and complexions and undertones and things like that, like I feel like I'm a master when it comes to getting my undertones correct or my clients' undertones correct because I, I, I like cohesiveness. So if you have this foundation, let me know if you like it. What are your thoughts? What are your takes on it? And yeah, thanks for wa watching, rating, subscribing. Thumbs this up. Peace and peace. I'm getting, I'm getting better at these tutorials. I'm, I'm getting on it. So we'll, we'll see how this goes. We'll see how this goes. Bye, these and Oh.